It's Pin Tam Z, y'all. We official all here. Gang gang in this thing. Insecurity laced with fear. The lies I digest while attempting to control outcomes that most likely will never happen. And hoping I don't die with every swallow. The hollow, empty absence of the truth that pleads for breath. When all I desire is for it to be put to rest. It's an oxymoron. It's living death. Insecurity is defined as lack of confidence or assurance. Self-doubt. Of course, when the focus is on myself, I doubt because the heart is deceitful above all things. But if it's the wellspring of life, how am I supposed to guard it? How is insecurity the opposite of secure if I am in security? Security is defined as freedom from care, anxiety, or doubt, and well-founded confidence. So if I'm in security, how am I lacking confidence? Is it really confidence or is it hope? And can one really exist without the other? Doubt is to be uncertain to have fear. To have that distressing emotion causing impending doom, whether it's real or not real. So if insecurity is self-doubt and fear, and security is well-founded confidence, where does confidence begin? It begins where doubt and fear end. At the end of self, and with the acknowledgement and the reverent awe of the divine creator, the fear of God is the beginning of all wisdom. And with wisdom comes assurance and confidence. Placing full trust and belief in the powers, trustworthiness, and reliability of a person or thing. Because blessed is the one who puts their confidence in him. That your hearts will be flooded with light so you can understand the confident hope he has given. The feeling that what is, wanted, can be, had, or the event will turn out for the best. Knowing the creator of all things has plans to prosper me and not to harm me. This is where my peace begins. So wait, what was I insecure about again? Oh yeah, we should focus on the wrong things because all the things are possible to him who believes. I just have to take the focus off of me, have faith, believe, and breathe. Because when my eyes look toward the divine, I can truly rest in security. And if you don't know who Pentam Z is, you probably live under a rock. <laughs>